Hey everyone, I'm super excited to show you a couple cool new updates for Misty Studio. If you are a Safari user, or if you want to access local API from a remote device, such as a different computer or even a phone, uh, these updates are for all of you. And if you've paid any attention to us in the past, you know what we're really striving to do is create a frictionless solution for you all. And it's not gonna necessarily be that way right away with everything that we do, but that is what we're trying to constantly iterate towards. We want everything to just work for y'all just to be able to pop it open and start doing what it is that you need to do. For the Safari users that tried out Misty Studio, uh, you probably have seen a screen like this where you can't progress past it. So there's a, a bit of a, a constraint that we're working around and we'll continue to work around because again, we wanna make this even more frictionless. But there's a constraint where Safari can't tap directly into the local AI. Now you can, we have a, a pretty cool workaround with our new update to Sidecar, which is gonna be available in version 0.3.0. If you don't yet have Sidecar, you could download it directly from this screen right here. Just click on the drop down, and then select the download option that is right for you. And I already have it installed on my Mac. It's running in the background. So if you go up to your toolbar and click on the little misty sidecar icon right there, I've already upgraded my version to 0.3.0. If you haven't done that already, then you'll see a little prompt right here that asks you to download it. It will download it, install it, and then relaunch sidecar. And once that has completed updating and is now showing 0.3.0, Notice the enable tunneling with local AI experimental. This is a fresh off the press experimental feature. So just keep that in mind when using it. But what we'll do is go ahead and click on that. And we're gonna give it a couple seconds here to start running and then click on the icon again. And then you should see the option to disable tunneling, which is great. That means the tunneling is currently working. And what we wanna do is click on copy tunnel connection info. And that's essentially gonna just copy a URL to your clipboard, which we'll use here. So let's start first with Safari. We're essentially gonna do the same exact steps for both Safari on my Mac here, as well as on my iPhone over here for a remote connection. But starting again with Safari, let's click on add provider. And then in the models provider dropdown, you'll just wanna scroll down and click on Misty Sidecar local AI proxy. And then paste in that link in this area here and then click on add provider. All right, we saw the screen refresh and now we see Misty Sidecar Local AI Proxy with five models available. That is awesome. Now we're ready to go, so let's go. And look at that. We can now use Misty Studio using Safari. Let's go ahead and ask it a question. And check that out, the earth is indeed a sphere. And now for the remote connection, and I'm just mirroring my iPhone right here, but this could be any other device. It could be an Android phone. It could be another computer in another room that I have. It could even be in my neighbor's computer across the street. But essentially it's, it's all the same setup. We'll click on add provider. And then under models provider, scroll down, click on Misty Stockcar local AI proxy. And then paste in that same URL that we copied earlier. And then click on add provider. And there we go, we've tunneled into the remote where we again see Misty Sidecar Local AI Proxy with five models available. So let's click on Let's Go. And perfect, we are now remotely accessing the local API I have on this Mac from an external iPhone. And why not ask it a question? And again, good to know that the Earth is a sphere. We hope you enjoy these updates. Again, we're super excited about this, reducing friction for you all and Again, I, th I think you could see where we're probably going with all this, and I hope you all are getting just excited as we are. Thanks again for watching this, and if you have any questions, feel free to comment below.